Brooklyn Park is hosting a championship event this week. The 2014 Wheelchair Softball World Series started Thursday and games are being played at three locations in Brooklyn Park. Eric Nelson is live at the Community Activity Center with more. Hi, Eric. Hey, Alex and Mike. You know, there are 14 teams in this tournament, including some from Japan. One of the squads is the Deep South Hurricanes, who have rolled north into Minnesota from the heart of Dixie. One, two, three. Here to win! It means the world to most of us. The Hurricanes blew into Brooklyn Park today, hoping to roll their way to wheelchair softball success. Basically a team representing Mississippi, Alabama, Louisiana, and one from South Carolina. Oh, yeah! They were laser focused going into their World Series game against Illinois. Win or lose, we go home together. We travel together. We're still practicing together. Deep South pitcher Chris Etheridge. Hey, we're here to win and to work hard. Hey, and to give everything we've got every play. Is the quintessential wheelchair softball player. The chair changes nothing. <laughs> when we line up against the 10 that we're playing, there is a uh, or, uh, and, and, uh, beyond average disdain for each other. He was seriously injured in a car accident nine years ago in Mississippi. It's life, brother. I'm a much better guy now than I was before I got hurt. Yeah. For a softball junkie like Etheridge, it was devastating. When I got hurt, I thought softball was behind me, that it was done. But thanks to rolling softball, Etheridge has kept his passion alive. And then people need to understand is that most of these wheelchair athletes were athletes before we got hurt. And you look for an outlet and, and you know, depression can come. If you don't find it, all kinds of bad things can come. The benefits of active living are no different for a person with a disability than an able-bodied person. Some might argue even more important, more impactful. Etheridge and the Hurricanes are impressed by the state-of-the-art venue in Brooklyn Park. Fence, a school board, this is the real thing. Uh, as real as we'll probably ever get again. And uh, so it puts us back where we were before we got hurt. It's a good thing for the community and it just demonstrates a commitment to um, play for all people. The uh, Wheelchair Softball World Series runs through Saturday here in Brooklyn Park. There is a local team involved, the Minnesota Rolling Twins. In Brooklyn Park, I'm Eric Nelson reporting live for Channel 12 News. Thank you, Eric. And real quickly, I understand this is not exactly a non-contact sport, is that right? <laughs> No, you see collisions out here, especially in the base paths, because it is difficult for these guys to get out of harm's way. We saw a couple earlier today, but luckily nobody injured. Wow. Sounds like they're going all out. Thank you, Eric. All right.